Hey, what up? This is your boy, the Solo Traveler ORD, and thanks again for checking out another one of my videos. Of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and to hit that bell while you are here. So I got some sad news coming out um, out of Europe. It seems it seems as though the 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 Al, Al, Italia that actual airline is going out of business unfortunately Jesus Christ. sad that this is happening so basically they're saying that they're selling no more flights and their last flight is october 15th so for those of you that actually like to fly with them to go out to italy no more that i think i believe the 25th i'm sorry i believe the 15th is their last flight out that they're doing and that's it no more is going on um kind of sucks because um, that's another airline that's going to be gone. So basically all the airlines can raise their rates because you know, we like to have competition out there for airlines. And when they start folding, other airlines are able to take advantage of the situation. And of course they'll start driving up the rates. And of course, we're the ones that get hit with those, with those new rates, because we like to travel. We like to see different places. So this will affect us in so many ways. Well, but nonetheless, they were saying that <clears throat> the reason being why they're going bankrupt is because of the pandemic. So they're unable to, to get any bailout. They're una unable to even recoup the money that they were making before the pandemic. So that's what caused the problem. So, but it's sad to see this, but nonetheless, let's jump into the article, show you guys exactly what was going on. So this is from the article far it says right here, um, at Italia is shutting down with all future flights canceled starting October 15th. So it says here, these are the final days of Italian carrier Al Italia. The government-owned Italia Transport Aero, or ATA, I mean, sorry, ITA, will become Italy's national carrier. Well, yeah. For, for those of us who have flown um, out of Italia countless times, either to travel to, to Italy or elsewhere within Europe, is the end of an import imperfect era. The Italian carrier is closing its doors on October 15th after serving as Italy's national carrier for 75 years. Effect, effective August 25th, Al Italia is no longer selling any flights for beyond October 15th. All flights, all, all Al Italia flights that have been scheduled to fly after October 15th have been canceled. The Italian state-owned airline, which is part of the Sky Team alliance that includes Delta Airlines, Air France, and K KLM, has had long-standing financial problems and declared bankruptcy in May 2017. Add to that, the global pandemic, which dealt a devastating blow to the airline's industry. Countless flights around the world were grounded for months last year, and international travel demand has still not returned to pre-pandemic levels. So once again, you know what I usually do, I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave a, a link to the article in the description below. So you guys could, could take a look at the rest of this article. But from what, from what it's saying here is that, you know, that's it after October 15th, that is the end for this airline. And like I said before, it is sad to see this. So, Hey, you're going to have to look for other airlines and this gives other airlines a set up to raise their rates because there isn't any com competition out there. So fortunately, I had to file bankruptcy and this kind of sucks, but this is what it is. This is the news that's going on. Well, this is your boy, the Solo Traveler ORD. Thanks again for checking out the video. Of course, don't forget to like, subscribe and share and hit that bell. And I am out.